Hello everybody, JR Brooks here, and uh, today what I got for you guys is my little alternative build of the 2010 uh, Rebel Trooper Battle Pack. Awesome. Sorry. Sorry. Alright, here we go. Now it's leveled up. Alright, so this is my review of the Rebel Trooper Battle Pack from 2010. Except it's an alternative build, and I'm going to put that in the title. Um, yeah, so this is uh, my little alternative build. It's been turned into uh, a first order, like, speeder thing. Um, that's really what I decided to turn it into. So uh, let me just show you the new figures really quickly. So first up here we have... Um, hold on. We have uh, a first order, um, like, officer. We have a first order officer. Then back here we got we have a first order gunner or a first order crew member. Then in the back we have General Hux, and we um, this is just a main figure that I put together. This is kind of like a um, I guess like a juggernaut or like gunner guy for the first order. So that's um so those are the main figures in the set. So let me take out the main figures. Just gonna leave that there. Let's continue. Uh, let's hope you didn't see my face. Alright, there. That shouldn't fall now. Okay. Okay, so up here, um, as you can see, there, the set was originally built, so this is all like. Just, this is like, fill, this is, these pieces are filling up that, are filling up this. And then there's kind of like this big gun up here, and there's this guy sitting back here who's a rebel. Now, I've changed this so the set is like an actual gunner. Um, so you could fit, um, you could probably fit too many, you can only fit really too many figures in there. Um, if you want to add something like this that I did on the back there, um, so you can fit a guy like that, you can do that too. Um, I think that's really nice, um, just to put some stormtroopers into battle. Um, so I think I'm gonna call this the general, the general's um, speeder, speeder bike. Um, so yeah, that's what I would call it. Um, if this was kind of like an actual set, like the general's speeder transport, that's what I would call it. I think that's a better name. Obviously, if this was actually a set, like if this was, if there was actually a set, I'm sorry, about like his speeder transport, whatever. If there, if that's in the movie, I don't know. I haven't seen it yet. But if if um, there's actually a speeder transport for him, obviously it'll be much bigger. Probably fit around four main figures in it. So yeah, that's really um, the side. And let's go on to the other side. Now on the other side, it's just the same thing. Not much. Just this little piece here to to push things forward or hold it back so you can come to a stop. So that's really it um, for this thing. You can put the guy on the gunner right back there very easily. Uh, I would recommend putting something right there if you decide to build this set like this. Otherwise, if you try to put him down, then the gun just faces upwards and you can't really do anything. And so yeah, I would put something there. Uh, I should have put something there, but uh, I, don't know, I just forgot all about it. So yeah, you, but I think it's kind of good if you don't put something there. This way you can turn sideways and shoot like that, you know, so he's not attached to anything so you can move him, you know, uh, I think that's kind of good. So that's really it for my, um, my little review of this thing. So yeah, uh, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna put in the title that this is a uh, 2010 Rebel Trooper Battle Pack and I'm just gonna put in parentheses alternative build and um, yes. So that's really it for this thing, guys. Oh, and also, if you want to, like, make believe that you're actually having a battle, um, the bad thing about this is that, like, this guy can't shoot because, you know, you get up and, bam, you get your head blasted off. And now you're dead. So, you know, if, um, if you want to, like, set up, like, a battle or something like that, you want to, like, play with it, you can't, uh, I recommend not doing that. Build, build up a little higher. If you're gonna do that, I don't know. I, 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 uh, I uh, personally would not want to get shot by my own gunner. 
But yeah, so that's really it for this little alternative build, guys. Uh, I'm going to be giving my thoughts of, um, of um, DC superhero sets this Sunday. I'm going to be doing Ask Jarabricks episode 2. So uh, make sure to keep your eyes peeled for those for those videos, guys. And I have done a, um, a video earlier in the day, um, around like 3.30 or so, saying my thoughts on the Moss Eisley Cantina set. So make sure to look out for that if you haven't seen it already. So thanks guys for watching and um, yep, thanks well, thanks again and uh, have a good day or a weekend, wherever you are.